Welcome to the October 2015 Global Sources Electronics Show in Hong Kong. I'm here with Maya from Rivogi, and Rivogi has launched some new products at the show. Maya, can you tell us more about this smart meter plug? In October, we are launching our new product, Smart Meter Plug, a Wi-Fi controlled uh, socket that enables you to control any device, any plug-in device from your smartphone or, an, or a tablet. Uh, it's pretty easy to use, you just plug in the smart meter and plug in your device, for example, your lamp, and you can turn on and off remotely from uh, your mobile device. It also uh, measures the power consumption in a real time, as well as a history power consumption uh, one day in a week or last month. So you can also see how much power is consumed altogether or if your product is consuming more and more when it's getting older. Uh, you can also set a timer for your smart meter to turn it off in, let's say, in half an hour. When you go to sleep, you want your lights to turn off uh, automatically. And also you can set some schedules for your smart device, uh, which is plugged in into the meter. Uh, for example, a coffee machine in the morning to brew it before you wake up. Uh, or a TV to turn off automatically when you go to sleep. Maya, you've been in the smart home market for uh, almost three years. What kind of trends are you seeing nowadays? Um, we know that smart home market is very new and it's just starting. Uh, so many people are still not really sure what this product can do. Uh, and our job right now is to educate people, to tell them not about our product and its features, but also what it enables, enables you to do, right? what you can do while having this product. Uh, not only turn it on and off, but also that it allows you to set a schedule for your uh, appliances at home or uh, keep your home safe thanks to some of the features. Which markets are you mostly selling your products to? Um, at the moment we are selling in United States and in Europe, but we see some trends in the Southeast Asia and Middle East uh, where people are getting more and more interested in the smart home devices as well.